Security First Corp. Safety through knowledge. What is a WPA key on PS3? Have you ever wondered what that mysterious WPA key is when setting up your PS3 for wireless internet? Let's dive into it. When you're connecting your PS3 to a wireless network, you'll come across a setting called the WPA key. This key is essentially a password that secures your wireless connection. Think of it like the lock on your front door. Without the right key, nobody can get in. On your PS3, you can set this WPA key manually if you need to. Here's how it works. When you go to the network settings, you'll see an option to enter your SSID, which is the name of your wireless network. Alongside this, you'll need to set the WLAN security setting. And for remote play, you can only select WPA PSK, AES, which is a type of encryption method. The WPA key itself is the encryption key that you enter to secure your connection. You can choose any key you like, but it's important to remember it because you'll need it if you change the network connection settings on either, either your PS3 or the device that supports remote play. This key is displayed as a series of asterisks, so you won't see the actual characters, but you'll know it's there. If you decide to change the SSID and WPA keys on your PS3, you'll also need to update these settings on the device that supports remote play. This ensures that both devices can still communicate with each other securely. So in simple terms, the WPA key on your PS3 is like a secret password that keeps your wireless connection safe and secure, and it's something you'll need to remember and update if you make any changes to your network settings. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.